Alright, hello once again YouTube! Welcome back to some Super Robot Wars, because we're also doing a bit of this today. Also recording a bit of this. We should actually have some episodes to go out for once, which would be nice. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I can't remember whose turn we're on. I think two of the guys that were trying to get some kills wiped out a couple of weakened units, and then we're just on to kind of the rest of the uh, the army, and I think the main group of... Yeah, as I was say, Dove and um, Jonah are charging up the middle to go for the boss. In fact, they probably need help, so char. Reasonably tough, go up after him. Dan can finally get a hit in. He's been really struggling on that. My van even. Ah, god damn it. I was getting too confused. This is robot. I appreciate the Gaga Gar theme, but it isn't your mission. Or it isn't your uh, fighting man. I got him. This was a decent damage. Right, yeah, these things aren't the eyes or whatever. These are the supposedly different unit. Oh, that went too bad damage wise. Right, um, who's next? Right. So we've got those big cardinal cannons. Uh, 69% hit rate. Nice. Um,. We'll risk it. We've got what's her name helping out, so. Marabel? Marabel? Marbit? I don't remember her name. I think it's Marbit. Check in a minute. Oh, doesn't matter. No, I'll go hit. And scoot away. Marbit. This is her, right? Oh, it's Jumbo. Fair enough. Good guy, you get in there anyway. You're here, you can help. It's huge damage, but it's to be expected really with a gammon lot. Pretty sure her and Kony are uh, like C tier in terms of actual like stats and everything, but I like them. Uh, we'll do... Oops. Plus I like the, uh, the attacks that have multiple machines in them. Oh, come on, that was so close. I'm gonna get hit back. These things do punch quite hard. Oh, we're okay. You've already acted, yep. Uh, you two. Should be able to finish that off. Ooh, don't like that hit rate. Uh, I'll just hope for the best of that. God, that's an awful hit rate. What the heck? Is this thing evasive? I know I have an upgraded kid in that for a little bit, but they shouldn't be that bad, right? Well, we got the hit anyway, but even still. Wow, there really is nothing. <laughs> I thought it was only a little fancy to that animation, it really is just the charge, huh? Decker, bust out the big gun and shoot something that's not even in his postcode. It does bring a smile to my face to try and think how big that motorbike actually is. Like, from what I vaguely know about Jadaka's size, that motorbike is like the size of a lorry trailer, I think. It's huge. It's just his bike. Would a bike even work at that scale properly? Might have to have some curved tyres at any rate, I don't know if those square ones would work at that scale. Yeah, 
Now that hits very hard still. But yeah, that was like 8k damage. I didn't even do anything special with it. Is J Decker just really hard hitting? I guess he must be. I mean, I knew it was pretty hard hitting, but I don't know if it was that good. Katamaru. To be fair, not difficult. He's only got one. Uh, I'm pick his moves we could try to copy. He's got bootleg rocket punch, and that's about it. Crit, nice. I can assume you dodged that. Why'd you say that? He was the one that got clipped on something like a one percent hit rate move and died <laughs> at one point. I, I do remember that. And of course, the best theme for any of the moves that we have in this game at the moment. Go. I don't know what you are or what you want. Or who you are or what you want. Frankly, I don't care. Stay there and watch. I'll show you what Gadda and I can do when we work together with our comrades. That's surprisingly kind of you, Ryan. down this time. Uh, right, is that everything? I think that's everybody. No, I have missed someone. It's going to be one of the ones that's already a bit greyish, isn't it? Yep. So, so? No, that's Marbet. It was Marbet. Okay. I can't remember her fucking name. Uh, nope. Just moving. The others might have to hurry up a bit. We are on a time limit on this one. We've got to take out that orange thing. If you want to help out a little bit, uh, we'll turn the animation off for the sake of getting on with this one. We'll try and remember to turn it back on if that boss enemy comes up. Literally can't hit Jonah. Dodge. They're literally just not fast enough to hit us. Uh, Ernie, still trying to build up that uh, build up that gauge. Oh yeah, he's got loads of SP. He can use focus. Come on, you're, you guys aren't even the ones I want to fight. Is that big guy gonna come chase us? We're close enough to get his attention yet? Yeah, there's the death frisbee on the crit. No, he's still coming back. What are we on? Objective. Shoot him down within six turns. What turn are we on? Three, okay. okay. How close can we... Oh, wait, doesn't charge let us... Use any weapon after moving. Let's get the, the the gravity rifle off on him. Okay, so we can do that. And then let's see if we can... Support this, yeah. Let's see if we can do a... Oh, ah, smash it. Costs less. Good man team giving us a helping hand. EX, smash it. All types of critical front turn. Here we go. Can we boost it further with anything else? We can do a focus. 
triple zero oath over omega emission that is spooky sounding attack name i don't want the universe to end absolutely not understandable you do live in it uh sake of those people trying their best to save to live their lives and for my own sake i will stop you whatever you are Look here it is, it's like a red and orange, like, Genesis gather car, they weren't kidding. It's kind of hard to see from the distance, but... What the heck? Nothing? Did that do no damage? Ah, uh, we might have a problem, that's one of the hardest hitting attacks I got. Dodge the counter, but uh, we have a problem. That was a hundred percent hit rate, and it didn't connect. But <laughs> let me just regen anyway. Okay, I don't think we can hurt it at the moment. It took no damage. What the hell? What kind of cheap trick is that? Damn it! How are we supposed to stop this thing? Okay then. Take down the surrounding Zero Robos first. In the meantime, gather as much data as you can on the Conqueror King. This is all we can do for now. Ah, it's changed. Feet all the AI 15s within what, six turns. Okay. If we can't take down the boss, we'll take down the help. Our fourth build target. Yeah, I might do that for the animations from now on. Like, skip the enemy's turn. Oh, we did use the tiger beam! Hooray! I forgot, yeah, he finally got the... He finally got an actual chest tiger beam. As opposed to the gun thing that was called that, but didn't actually use it. Yeah, I can't complain, you're fine. Oh yeah, Ernie wanted to get some more shoot downs than me. Um, yeah, just clip that one off. And then, some to go. Oh, is that map? Is that? Oh, can anyone say map attack? That's that's one of them as well. Yeah, Jonah, uh you mind moving just for a minute, mate. No, actually let's send you up here because we might still need to fight that thing. Stand by. Okay, he's still gonna attack, but it's fine. Can we do we can't. Can we do we have a part? We did gain that. Wait, what is it? What should you go for EX orders? Who's the XC morale? Stats up. Oh, why not? Everyone else a bit of a boost. And then. It's our canisters. Oh, I should have used an intuition. Oh, well, it should hit all. Yeah, the battleships in this game are strong. <laughs> Precisely because they have a habit of getting to a point where they can do stuff like this. I think she's about to. I think she is actually about to drop four of them in one volley. Ah, oh, look at that! Beautiful. Just did about half the party's work for them. And get yourself in range. You might be able to drop your uh, the MMFA on the, on it. Whatever the uh, the big laser's called, I can never remember. Right, can you shoot that thing out of existence? Not quite, but you can hurt it. Now yeah, that's gonna work, so we'll move on. Go, go, go! Let's get you... No, let's hold off on you. See if we can get you to fight that thing. I bet you can finish this one off. Hopefully. Uh, <laughs> Two thirds hit rate's not bad. That's fairly good odds. <laughs> Yeah, 
Hey, good shot. That last one? It was. It did down to zero rivers. We'll be able to prevent the formation of the black hole if we can't damage this thing. Remember the Conqueror King. Huge increase in energy detected from the Conqueror King. Oh, well, what's he doing now? No. That's his emission thing, isn't it? Ah. His strength is out of this world. No way, is this the power? It's being used for destruction. Look, it's dimensional tear. I'm in tears too. <laughs> God damn it. That's the same thing they saw when they took Thanatos away. They're coming. They're coming. Oh dear. Better, man. Oh dear. What the heck are those? They're not human, are they? No, it's these guys. Betterman Lamia. Yes, I say, you said these guys before. What are you talking about? There's our Betterman, no doubt about it. These can also form by ingesting animus seeds. There's six of them. Betterman came in to fight against the Conqueror King. Covering such a great distance is but a moment. Hmm, this Socius? Path is quite convenient indeed. There's usually on the way back as well. Quit it, you're pushing Sarah too hard. Thank you, Kajumaru, but I'm alright. I mean, your yeah, pupils are kind of gone. Your, your, uh, the whites of your eyes are kind of gone red. Uh, there might be some bleeding. I don't know, it's not going all that well. Mind you, this guy's not like this a great idea on that note. Rice. Now, now, my good friends, the Conqueror King is right before our eyes, see? It's time for we Somnium to join our forces. Basically, they've all got the red eye now, look at it. Hmm, I suppose I should put in some work. Hectofolic Sancta. Okay. Merge. They're gonna combine? They're gonna combine, aren't they? Oh, we're getting a video clip? No, they combined. They turned into a dragon? Might have been transformed into monsters and merged together. They're extremely dramatic about this. Cataphract. Call it Cataphract. Yeah, well, that's what we're calling it. There's a chimera looking at it, but. Attacking the Conqueror King. But to help them, the Venom want to stop it, just like us. Uh. say so we tried attacking it before, it doesn't do anything. Nothing seems to work. Yeah, that's the problem. I don't think of it. Ghost just said we're looking at a projection of the Conqueror King. In other words, we're dealing with some kind of force field compressing Jupiter. This rate is really good attempt to a black hole. I don't think there's anything we could do about that, right? Like, we'd have to put out force equivalent to enough to compress a planet into a black hole. I don't know if we can do that. What happens then? Trust me, you don't want to find out. With how close we are to Maki, we all die immediately. Uh, I think. You might know, would, would it? Even if it turns into a black hole, it would be a really small one, right? Like... Yeah, it probably sucks these rocks in, but, like, the event horizon is probably tiny. You'd probably be okay, even at that distance. Like, the only thing we can do is keep attacking until something happens. Like, if your engines are already powerful enough to get you away from Jupiter, it's not going to pull any harder than that. It is only Jupiter's worth of mass. Damn it, is there really nothing we can do? I still hope, Shigeru. Sakura, what do you mean? Shigeru, send out the thing you're working on in the hangar. He will need it. Any one man ever called me Shigeru, are you? Ushi, launch the XF-111 towards the Conqueror King. Huh? Wh what for? Remember, Saka can catch waves of consciousness that drift through an area within the Limpid Channel. Well, th within an area through the Limpid Channel. A certain man who died within the Jupiter Sphere ten years ago. Or I should say, turned into a spirit. My uncle. What? Ray Shisho, the old GTG. My good uncle told me to do it. It's definitely worth a try. Sending the thing. Black hole is formed. XF Triple One fan Prototype Phantom Gal launching. Oh, it's a new engine? It sets the jetpack unit, right? What was that? I think it went inside the black hole. Time has come. Oh, I think I see. Bravery. I see. Uh, I knew this moment of bravery would come. Yeah, I was going to say, let me guess. It can travel through there so it can get Guy out. That voice? No way. That's the voice you can't forget. Guy. Okay. Don't recognize your machines, but if you sent me Phantom Gal, you must be Earthlings. That's right, Guy, with the drag crowds and the gutsy global guard. Get to rescue you and the rest of the guard. Mamoru? Is that you, Mamoru? Of course. Mamoru and Army from Earth. Fred is here too. 
see. Such a cool voice. <laughs> you have such a cool voice, though, Lamaru. Why, thank you, guy. It's definitely not just mine. Uh, you've really grown. No, this isn't the time. If I'm listening, this area has been flooded with triple zero. The energy that originated the universe will lead to its demise. Oh, boy. What the hell are you on about? What the heck of a greeting after ten years, man. At least give us more details. Numa, Koji, you're here, too. He says more, guy. Amara? Give a short version. Yeah, we're all here. Uh, I just went through a wormhole, passing the chase of time. It was there was overflowing where I was and followed me. I want to prevent the end of the universe, we first close the gate. Yes, we know it's guy. Strange, I feel like I could take out any chance by just hearing this voice. Ge genuine fact, um, guy's voice actor blew out like... I think it was like six mics across the recording of Final. Or it might have been Final Agar, or was it four? I think it was four. Like, the, the final attack shout blew out two mics and his voice for a while as well. He went so hard on it. Uh, which is pretty cool, not gonna lie. It's it's not... I don't know whether they put it on the same thing as, as Goku passing out from screaming, his voice actor. I can't think what her name is, but... And anyway, someone filled with bravery, a true brave. Y yes. <laughs> Found the writing. Uh, let's stand by his side, let's go. Very soon, it, it is going to show up. Who's going to show up? What do you think? Oh. Being eroded by Triple Zero, the King of Conqueror's Thralls. Conqueror King Genesic. Ah, not that at all. This is bad. Here it is. It's finally arrived. Ah. About to say here means one thing. It's got a physical body now. <laughs> or we can kick its friggin' butt. Thank you, Reva. Triple Zero that covers its body is keeping the wormhole open. Push it to the other side. Ah. Copy that. Send me your spare gal machines. You ready to go? Wait, you cousin? Yeah, I'm ready as it can be. Auto Fusion approved. We. Oui. Auto Fusion program drive. Ah, she's the one in charge of that now. Cal Figar. Ah, okay. Your yeah, braves. Which bounces a traitor has made his glorious return to our solar system. You bought our ID armor too? On the ball. Yeah, look at him. He's giddy as a schoolboy. Stay happy for your memory. Why is returned? Is Benjamin? He came here to fight the Conqueror King as well. They're not our enemies. Uh, I don't know about that, but they're on our side at the moment, at least. Let's go, guy. Together, the two King of Braves will defeat the Conqueror King. We sing Galfi Gar? Is that the reserve he uses at the start of Final? Do you have a Brave? Probably is, right? Is this um, what I think it is? It is! Hello, Galfi Gar. We haven't seen you for some time. Yeah, so in the original, he uses Gal Gaga. Um. But Galleon, which is the solar line core unit, is gone at that point. Uh, at, the, at the end of the series, he's got, he goes back, I think, to his old solar system. So we get Gal Figar, where they built a new core unit, and I think the rest has been upgraded. And then we later go to um, uh, Genesis Gal Gaga, uh, which is technically this guy, right? For looks, at least. Yeah. And then, I guess they built, uh, I'm trying to remember, but I believe it said they built Gagago -Go in the intervening time. So we've got like four of them now, blimey. Oh, he's on EXE 10! Yo! I don't think I'm going to be able to do more than that, but... Uh, yeah, direct attack would help, actually, as well. Spirit, spirit, uh... None of those are tremendously useful at the moment, but we'll see what his hit rates are. Weapon Phantom. Actually, why can't we use Hell in Heaven? Is it just range? It's range. Yeah, let's go straight for the finisher. Okay, yeah, we will use uh, Resist. Let's see what he's got. Well, we might have seen these animes before. Ah, hang on there, Galleon. Soon you'll be free. Right, yeah. I guess... I guess Gal... I guess Genesis Gal Gal is still on the other side. I don't think it actually got destroyed. It got damaged, but... And we're saving everyone else. This, I swear. Good. I was never too keen on the original ending for final. It felt a, a bit strange that everyone just got left behind, I guess because they were planning this and just didn't get to do it, but... Gold finishing move. Well, I got the hammer. Is there a call to rip out of this one? I don't know, but we can pull something out. 
Hey, very good. Lots of damage. Oh yeah, we can see what this attack looks like when it actually connects with something. Which I think it's something we're going to want to avoid doing, because I have a feeling it probably hits quite hard. Oh, other cat. How are you, Luna? You don't normally come all the way up here. Oh boy. <laughs> He's got the wall up. That looks like it's hurting hard. Oh god, it's got, oh god, it's got morale down. That's never good. Cat has decided to show up and make her appearance very much known. Yeah. Is it you? I'm trying to record for YouTube here. I don't even know if the audience could hear me saying that. Wow. Oh dear. What? I'm going to have to pause here. Sorry about this, YouTube. One moment. Uh, well, I have no idea what she wanted. I became very insistent about something, but... No idea what. Let's get everyone moving up. I've just realised I probably ought to be a little bit careful with this boss, because I reckon it's got an AoE on it, now that I think about it. I bet that attack could be a map attack. Well, I need to be a little bit careful. Yes, I turn out to be right about that. I've still got, I think, two turns to beat it. Not really on turn three, no, we've got ages yet. Oh wait. You know we don't have control over it, it is AI at the moment. Here he goes. Psychogravity. Hmm. Are we siding with the source of evil, Lamia? I intend to deal with him, but right now. Dealing with the champion clad in the aura of dawn takes priority, wouldn't you say? Hmm, I suppose there's no arguing that. Very well then. For now we must defend our hope, as well as man's hope. Whatever you say, my dude. Okay, so they hit pretty hard. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll, we'll be able to do this if that's the sort of damage he's doing now. So he gets KO'd by this in retaliation. Yeah, you guys don't seem to be of much risk. You could probably win this on your own. I'm gonna be honest. Not that we're gonna... Oh, he's just got an extra attack as well. Um... Right, little help. <laughs> Turn is probably fast enough to get away from that. <laughs> Damage, but not a lot. Right. We do have something bigger we can hit him with, though. You're a part of the cannon. Oh yeah, it's not the MFA. What the heck? Or is it the MFA? MFA so. What is the MFA? Why is the name different? Very good hit. Run me into his counterfire. Yeah, the way better, man. 
Even if you can't do this on your own, we're gonna do it anyway. Spanish hit. Go to heaven and hell again, although we can skip the animation this time. Just sin it. Namaru Koji and everyone. We're all growing so much. What happened while we were in the trinary solar system? No, I can't think about it right now. We have to stop the Conqueror King first. Only then can we celebrate this miraculous reunion. Another 10k or so. Oh, is he about to full heal? Ugh, what's it doing? We're trying to fill us with triple zero or two? Guys, is that Genesis Gaga girl? Or is the real one eroded by triple zero? Before it got to me, Galleon broke the fusion to let me escape. Ah, he did? Yeah, that's why I had to stop Genesis. I can't battle with you, Galleon, like this. Guy, please tell me, are Jay and Tomaru? Forgive me, I don't know what happened to them. It's good. You hear me? If you didn't see them die, I'm sure they're still alive. <laughs> Kinda knows what's up. He's, he's, he knows what's going on here. We'll definitely meet them again. Copy that, let's do it. Hold on to your hearts, never get into fear. Let your bravery guide you. You got a guy, we'll never lose. Let our tails turn to its thrills. Right, we have another big hitter. Uh, Kosuke. Kosuke, give us a hand. Don't know whether we'll be able to take it down here, but... Often personnel kit. Right, um... I'm getting there, let's get... Oh, is he seriously not fast enough? No, he should be. Come on, you got to get in there. Gaga Gar's fighting. That's if I lined him up right, wouldn't it? Who will view that one? I didn't give the music to the same. Get in there, it's got about 6,000 to go. Jonah, I don't think we'll be able to knock him out, but we'll hit him with it anyway. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to do this, but... Well, we can do it, or the Batman get the kill, which I'd really prefer we didn't. I'd like that XP. Getting there, but just got a little too much left in him. Oh, right, we can survive that much damage. Can get anyone else in range this turn? Not quite, I don't think. Are you feeling fast? Or maybe. No, nope, can't attack at that range. Don't worry about the rest, they could be miles out. Yeah, Batman's gonna get killed. God damn it. Kill stealing. I do have to say that, he did like 10k damage, he did hit them pretty hard. I see anyone watching this one, see how it explodes. Done, special mark. So poops. Conquer King has stopped moving. Is it over? No, not yet. Mamoru, Kaido, lend me your strength. What do you have us do, guy? We use both Hell and Heaven. Oh, we'll both use Hell and Heaven and extract Galleon's Black Box and G Stone at the same time. I get it, we may use. Uh, Genesate, but at least we say Galleon. You got it, here goes. So a Galleon bill with it. What? Exploded the Genesate bolt for propellers. Why, Galleon? 
Elliot. Did we get dragged in the black hole? What happened? Oh, Jupiter's just back. <laughs> Look, it's Jupiter. Jupiter's back. Yeah, I just said that. Is it turned normal now? We stopped the uh, black holeification. There's more to it than that. It's likely that the power has rewinded time before this all happened. What about the Conqueror King? Well, the signal's detected. It's completely gone. And we won. Chalk another one up for humans. We saved the Earth from triple zero, and we got Guy back. No, yeah, we did save them. Huh? Prevented them from both becoming creatures bent on destroying the universe. Yes, yes, you're right. Ah, here he is. Intelligent life forms who threaten cosmic law. Do not assume there is only one Conqueror King. His voice. That's. Oh. Another Conqueror King. King Jada. Oh! It's not Pizza, it's Jada, it's the actual ship. Jay? Jay, is that you? No, it is Pizza. Hello! Wait, was his name actually Jay? Am I remembering wrong? I'm a guy in Latio, we will not stop here. To uphold the cosmic law, all her intelligent life must be eradicated. Conqueror's battleship Jay Arc set sail. It's not really your guy's battleship, is it? You just pinched it. Wait, Jay, listen to. Identify craft, less sensor range. Heading to Earth. I'm freaking on Earth. The path. Yeah. <laughs> She's just like, yeah. You know, the, uh, I think what the voice is from, just the, uh, yeah. Betterman. They're gone. It looks like they're looking out for us humans again. What do you mean, again? Were they ever actually on our side? I could be remembering wrong, but I don't remember them ever really helping us much before. All units return to base. We'll need to sort the intel we've gathered to come up with a new plan. Well, we've got a lot of catching up to do, guy. You're telling us what happened over there. Yeah, I would like to know too. Might not be how we quite imagined, but we all wanted to see you again. I know, I've got so much to tell you. Hey, you mind picking me up too? Voice. This is Professor, is he not actually dead? Is this ghost joining us? I hope that's what's happening here. It's a long time, everyone. Okay. Ah, I knew you'd make it back, Mr. Brave. But man, you haven't changed at all. Did I his age at a reduced rate? Hmm, can't say I've heard anything of the sort. Yeah, it looks like you've all grown a lot. Yeah, at times probably just a little different. Got about us. Someone here really needs to talk to you first. Ah. Uh, Amory, is that really you? Oh dear, sorry. Sorry, being weird. Hello, I'm Mamory or Mammy. Got to the gutsy Global Guard Mobile Squad. I didn't like the official welcome back. <laughs> ah, I finally said it. What of our first screen to feel former and proper. you become a man. Of course I have. Even I was going to grow up after ten years. Didn't really sink in till now, but it seems that wormhole did send me into the future, huh? You're saying that... My perspective has only been about a day. Oh, Christ. So he sent you memory back to Earth for our last DS missiles. Well, at least they weren't waiting. Excuse me? So that is why you look exactly like we remember you. Well, it looks like we remember him. It literally is like we remember him. I huh, guess we don't get to call you old man. <laughs> right, some of you are actually older than me now. Oh, how about I do it instead? You look well for your age, Grandpa Rio. <laughs> Respect your elders. <laughs> Little jokes aside, I'd feel weird if you started calling me Mr. Cabado or something. Let's set the record straight. We stand as equals. Sound good? Sounds good. Welcome back, guy. A long time, guy. Shigeru. That's right, Chika Komatsu is one of the sons of Dr. Raigas. I met some guy's cousin. Guy, there's someone else has been dying to talk to you. I wouldn't even have bought the prototype. Ah, I wouldn't even have bought the prototype to Jupiter if it weren't for her. Okay. Oh, wait. God, have they met? I'm genuinely trying to remember. You've grown up quite a bit. That's rude. I say you greet a child. She told me something like you look lovelier than ever, mademoiselle. Is that so? I guess. <laughs> Lady, he's, he has a girlfriend, remember? Actually, that's a good question. Where is she? Where's, um. Oh, what the hell can't I remember her name? Oh, I liked her character as well, and I can't think of her name. Oh, I'll, get, I'll get back to you guys on that one if I remember it. Anyway, we can finally celebrate the return of a brave. Look at that guy. Like, I don't think she was injured particularly badly during the last fight or anything. I can't remember. We don't know what's happened to everyone else yet, I suppose. Good to be back, memory. That's all. Who's the summary of the current state of the solar system? That's a lot to take in. Oh, just for those phones going, no one's here. I better go get that one sec, YouTube.
Oh dear, two interruptions in one go and I couldn't even reach the phone in time. Cat never had the phone. Don't even know what the phone was about. Uh, it's your turn now, guy. Please tell us how you came to appear on Jupiter. Oh boy. So I set the stomach up off running up and down. Uh, as you know, GGG went to try and research this and fight against the planetary masses and eventually won. Yes, that's final, basically. At that time, the Gloria Comet, which acts as a dimensional gate connected to our solar system, has vanished. Because you took down only those who opened the gate in the first place. j -Arc only had two ES missiles left. We knew that if we used the power, we could launch those two missiles all the way to Jupiter without fail. So Kaido and I made it back to our solar system. Yeah, so basically they, they managed to send those two back, but that was all they could do. Uh, after that, we weighed our options and decided to take a very risky bet. What do you mean? Tell us that Galgogar, the legacy of the green planet, Mamre's homeworld, had various features that we hadn't been able to fully analyse. One of them was the gadget tool Gloria Road. Name implies we might be able to create a comet. Ah, okay. Right, however, we had no way to know how to control it. We opened a gate far into the future, praying it would connect us to our solar system. Instead, we arrived at the orange site. What now? It's a recent cosmological theory. Supposedly, before the Big Bang happened, all of the energy that would form in the universe existed in a cosmic egg. That's incredible to say the least, but how did you know it was the orange site? It's my father who told us. Or dad, that would be Dr. Rio. The world's ten great minds, but I thought that... He died on Jupiter ten years ago, yes. However, it's not as quick as that. Well, he no longer has a physical body, thanks to the power his spirit still was on here on Jupiter. Oh, he's literally a ghost. It's not even like a joke, he is actually just a ghost. The world that leaves on, free of the bonds of the mortal body. Is that eternal life? That's a ghost, Jonah, come on. Stay with us. Uh, explains how he contacted me, to me during the battle. Power. So many things it could do, but it's so inexplicable. We found ourselves in a place brimming with that inexplicable energy. That was the orange site. The energy that will later form our universe. Oh, triple zero, okay. Power was just a small portion of it leaked through a small crack in the dimensional boundaries. Considering this is the energy that gone to form the entire universe, it's understandable how even a tiny portion of it would seem to us as a super energy. Power of destruction and creation. The energy behind both the creation and the beginning of the universe. Or the end and the beginning of the universe, even. Hold up, are you telling me you people are fine being inside that energy fest? No, we weren't fine at all. Oh. The spirit my dad was unaffected, however, anything with a physical body eventually turned into a thrall. Oh. That means... So thanks to the king, yeah, as the king... Mines are eroded by triple zero and their ethics are overridden. Well, mind control? No, it goes way deeper than that. It's not they're forced to act that way, they want to. Fully convinced from the bottom of their hearts they're doing the right thing. What is it they want to do? Silencing the universe, in other words, ending all intelligent life. Hmm. Makes sense, intelligent life is guilty of decreasing entropy, after all. Uh, maybe? Could you make it a little clearer for the rest of us? The universe was born in the Big Bang. Eventually all of its heat will be lost and it will end with the Big Crunch. However, the activity of intelligent life is altering in the universe's natural heat loss. So our very existence is halting the end of the universe. <laughs> I like that. It's like, ah, universe ain't gonna win, we're gonna do something about it. Yeah, no, that, that's fair enough with some of the technology they have in some of these shows. It's like, I could understand that, like, get a get a Emperor and, like, Tengatofa Gurren Lagan and that both have sort of power on that kind of scale, so... That is the reason why the Conqueror's Trails want to erase all intelligent life, for representing the natural flow of the universe's lifespan. The message Sacra caught in the channel has been the will of someone from GGG has become a thrill. That means everyone at GGG is. That is the wrong play power, but how are you, fine guy? Ah, okay, he was inside Ga 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 and it pushed him out. That's why I saw a Phantom Gal fly before my eyes. It's that wormhole connected Jupiter to the orange site. Korea must have known about it, that's why he had to send it that way. Turn it to the king and open the wormhole, yep. The guy came out of the wormhole right before the Conqueror King. Oh yeah, okay, uh, what will you be doing for now, guy? Render the dimensional boundaries of our solar system unstable. Yeah, we're getting the distortions. In other words, it... Was it anything might happen? It already has been. We've been getting the, the distortions. Browse wants to end all intelligent life, which means they're going to target the Earth sooner or later. Now back to Earth. Might be a traitor, but I must do something. I'll help you, guy. Yeah, it's turned into a thrall, this might just stop him. Also, it's been like 10 years. You guys clearly saved the Earth. I don't think they're that worried at this point. Mamoru, Kaido. Just go without saying, we all feel the same way. You have the support of the dry crowds. There you have it, guy. I'll let you hold the glory all every time. Everyone. Yes, as I was explaining earlier, our planet's already in danger. 
Not to call it an exchange of favours, but you could really use your help. And he's part of the team. What the hell are we doing robot-wise? I could be fighting alongside Guy. I look forward to that, Mr. Mobile Squad Captain. I said I'm worried about the Brennerman. Don't mind fighting at their side if they intend to help you, Mandy, but... Do you come from the hangar? Well, the AI block we retrieved after the battle is causing raising a ruckus about wanting to talk with Guy. Sending the audio your way. Could it be? Hey, can you hear me? Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's just Goldie Mark. That checks out. He would make a fuss. You look bigger. You pull a great combination? I dig it. You would just naturally grow, you know. Goldie Mark, how did you end up at Jupiter? That's the question, eh? Stay I was. Taking a snooze after I used up all my juice for the Goldian pressure. I felt this creepy energy invading me. Zero. It's feeling weird. That stuff was bad news. So I detonated the explosive bolt and ejected from the crusher. Like what happened, but caught in Phantom Cow's wing got dragged through that dimensional thing on the bob. <laughs> he just got stuck to it. Lucky guy. Uh, what a stroke of luck. Yeah. It was the battle guy got there by, but it wasn't much I could do as an AI block. So I sent an SOS and waited for someone to come pick me up. Me, you were tough, but wow, I am impressed. Yeah, Goldie, Goldie is tough. Look, he, he actually does take a lot of fire. There's the odd bit where he's like overly wrecked this, like gets hit because of it, and he's just fine. Like, <laughs> he does learn a bit still, but he, he like, doesn't die just because he's that tough. Um, eh, yeah, I know, I'm the coolest. So how about you build me a new body? Being a block sucks. All right, all right, we'll take care of it. Look forward to it, okay? Heck yeah, thanks, man. This so we received an emergency transmission from Fikes. Transmission? Stress to all of us, so I'll read it out loud. On completion of your mission to Jupiter, you return to Earth and head to the Phenom... Oh, God, that again. South Asia. Rather than a request, this sounds like an order. It's really bad if they're giving orders to a corpse like ours. Well, you've had the message. We're returning to Earth. This new fight begins. Yep. Nakodo. Nakodo! That's the girl's name. I couldn't think of it. G-Stone Shard. Ooh. Got a bit of a G-Stone back. Mission Ace. Bits of a water surprise after... <laughs> After dumping that missile barrage on four guys at once, and I'm pretty sure she hit two at once earlier on in that run too. Oh god. Ah, come on, I'm running out of time. The stream's going to start in three minutes. See official orders. We're going to investigate the area. Not on Thomas. I'll have to blow those off. Shots of grave emergency. They're directly there. Oh. Oh, I think it's telling me that I don't get a choice for the next mission. We're going there. Do I even get to save? We do. Emergency. Okay, hopefully you guys have all enjoyed. Nice getting back to this, although it's a pain in the ass. I'm going to have to edit it back together again. See you guys in the next one. Goodbye.